Welcome to this week's episode of STEM Club. I have a little toy and I've come outside to play with it because I have to uh, splash some water around. So let me show you what this is. This is a sort of sprinkler. It's a 3D printed part made by a friend of mine at uh, Eckert College. It's got a hose fitting on it so I can connect that to a regular hose. And it's got a series of one, two, three, four, five holes. Let me show you how those holes are set up. So they're all about the same size. This one comes out about like this. This one about like that. Let me turn it to the side a little bit here. This one about like that. This one about like that. And this one way down there. So you see those different angles going from very low up to very high. The water pressure inside here should be about the same. The holes are about the same size if it uh, all printed well. So there should be the same amount of water coming out of each hole and it's coming out at the same speed. I'm going to go connect this to the hose while you think about what that's going to look like. All right, so let's take a close look at what's happening here. You see the one farthest away is going straight up and it's not getting quite as far. The low angle one is getting pretty far and I've got a well here so we're, uh, water pressure is changing here a little bit as the well pump kicks on and off. So you can see how that changes as the speed changes. There are a couple, the second one and the fourth one, that have a point right here where they're all going kind of the same distance. I hope that comes out on the camera. Let me move around uh, the mud here, see if we can get some of the grass in the background. And the one that seems to be going the farthest is the one right in the middle. So if you're throwing something and you want it to go as far as possible, the best way to throw it is at about 45 degrees. <laughs> 